Good morning, everybody. Heading out a 10 mile river campsite this morning. And I'm making a slow stroll in to Bulls Bridge. Head into a little convenience store in Delhi. I'm gonna grab some coffee, uh, charge up my battery bank a little bit, perhaps grab some breakfast and slowly freestyle and uh, make my way north. Had a real nice camp spot last evening and I was very surprised to see Pollyanna and Crazy Quilt stop in at the end of the day. They were um, doing some slack packing yesterday and had to rearrange their cars and had some issues obtaining fuel um, due to the power outages up here. And I was just literally just very surprised um, to see them come strolling in the camp. It was great to see them. We had a great evening and uh, just a perfect spot right there by the river. Goal for the day. And my goals have been getting smaller due to my unfortunate injury to my right leg. Pretty convinced dealing with the shin splint. Appreciate all the advice and everything everybody's been giving me. And uh, I'm just going to move slow. And my goal for the day is going to be tentatively Kent, Connecticut. That's going to be just under 10 miles. I may stop in there. They have a, uh, a welcome center where they have coin operated showers and I can grab a shower for like $2. And I feel certain there's gonna be some campsites uh, somewhere in that area. So just gonna take it slow. I must admit I have been enjoying myself going a little slower. It gives you more opportunity to take in the sights along the way. I mean, just I'm strolling right here along the, the river bank here right now. And it's just an awesome morning here. Nice cool temperatures. So it is a little nicer to not feel quite so rushed. You know, you got to get those miles. You got to put them on the board. You got to go, go, go. So definitely going to take lots of breaks along the way. Continue to stretch, elevate my leg. And, uh, you know, prayers are appreciated, everybody. I don't want to, I don't want to come off trail for a couple of weeks and come back out and finish this up. So I'm going to have to make a decision here in a few days if things don't improve. Um, I may simply have to do that, but if I do have to pull off trail, it's absolutely not going to end my journey. I'm in this for the long haul. Um, nothing's going to take this dream away from me. So, um, again, I appreciate all the kind words of support that everyone has been offering me as always. So, still pushing north, everybody. Kicking and screaming all the way. Hey, I'm going to get there. Here we go. Thank you. 
a view from mile 1464.6. Mount Algo Shelter, mile 1469.8. Okay, everybody, looks like the Mont Algo shelter area is going to be home for the evening. Um, have my tent all set up and ready to go. This is going to be another under 10 mile day for me. Um, just keep in mind that I'm trying to be super careful with this shin splint. And I've been stretching, stretching, stretching all day long, rolling it out. And uh, I have some other things I'm using to try to, to reduce the uh, swelling. I'm um, trying to keep it elevated as much as possible. Um, I did take a stroll. I attempted to take a stroll from this location into Kent, Connecticut, because there is a, uh, a welcome center that you can purchase a shower for $2. And uh, it was 0.3 to the trailhead and then one mile in the town. And when I got into town, I realized that Kent, Connecticut is completely without power. And they have been since the, uh, the tropical storm um, blew through the area two days ago. So I had to turn right around and come back up the trail. And instead of going north, I'd received some information in the meantime that apparently the climb north of uh, Connecticut route, I believe it's 341, which is just ahead of me, there is a pretty nasty climb um, over the next mountain. So I figured I'd play it safe and just drop anchor here from tonight, get rested up, and try to put some more miles on the board tomorrow. Um, this afternoon, I do feel that my leg felt a little bit better but I still am in a tre tremendous amount of pain. Um, but it seems the more I stretch and kind of work it out, it does feel a little bit better. Um, so hopefully I'm on the road to recovery and I can start uh, you know, putting some better miles on the board. So um, that's where I'm at at the moment. I'm gonna get some editing done, get some rest done. Dinner's already over. So uh, I will see everybody in the morning. Take care, everybody. Thanks for watching Wild on a Trail. And uh, again, thank you so much for all the positive comments. Um, I haven't, you know, my spirits have been a little challenged here lately with everything that's been going on. And uh, your comments are definitely, you know, very uplifting. And I sincerely appreciate that. Good night, everybody. Take care.